Yo, what's poppin' people? Welcome back to another episode of Kicking Their Bass TV. Thank you guys so much for the support. Before we even hop into this one, I actually have a fan meetup Saturday, November 13th, this upcoming Saturday at Nine Line Apparel from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. We haven't had a fan meetup in a very long time, so I really want you guys to show up and turn out to this one. If you guys are in the Savannah area, or even if you guys wanna travel out to come meet me, I would love to meet you guys, shake your hands, talk some fishing, and I'd greatly appreciate it. But this Saturday, November 13th, Nine Line Apparel, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, also hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. Everybody's been telling us, hey, I wanna see some more pond videos. So that's what we're doing today. We're gonna to be pond hopping. I'm out at this beautiful pond right here and uh, we've caught a bunch of really big fish in the past here, guys. I haven't been here in a very long time, so I'm kind of pumped about it. I got a few poles with me, which I'm gonna show you guys what we have on and uh, just get the fishing. See if we can catch some big fish. If we can't catch them here, we're gonna travel around, hit a few other ponds and uh, all on out, just try to have a good time today. So let's go ahead and hop right into it. So I brought out a bait caster with me today and a spinning rod. If you guys wanna check out the kicking combos brought to you by Luz, you can check them out on my website, kickingtheirbass.com. I'll have the link down below. Also, if you guys wanna check out some of the merch and support your boy, I'd appreciate it. But I have a fluke on the spinning combo right here. And then on the bait caster, I have a little Texas rig with a Strike King Rage Crawl. If you guys wanna get a discount on any of the baits I use, link will be down below all right boys and girls we're gonna get this started today and i'm gonna start off with the old spinning combo with a fluke on it and there's actually some moving water in this pond i didn't think it was moving today but i can actually see it coming out we had a lot of rain this week this is actually after a heavy cold front as well and uh, these fish have been locked jaw this whole week it's been really tough so I'm really hoping to get on a few good fish today. Any fish that we catch today, I'm gonna to be happy with, but I would love to catch a giant or two. So we're gonna cover a lot of water, throw this fluke up on this bank, work it very slow, work it productively. If they're not eating it, we'll pick up that Texas rig and uh, just keep covering some water. So let's we'll see what we can get started here. Dude, that's money, but I'm in that tree. Oh, there you go. Oh. Maybe he'll eat it as a dangle. There I'm up there. I know there's one in that, dude. No way there's not fish sitting where that fresh water's coming in. Just I gotta like get it on that left hand side. Right there, that's right where I wanted it. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? what is this? He ate it, bro. I watched him eat it. I waited on him. Mm. Okay, okay. Okay. Whew. I'm about to lose it. Pretty fish too. Not a big one by any means, but hey, we got to start somewhere, guys. That is a pretty little bass. Beautiful markings on them in this tannic water. Not big at all, but hey, you got to start somewhere. Got our first fish on the fluke. <laughs> nah, we're just putting them back. Yeah, I don't know about in this water though. You know? They put all. Have you? I don't know. It's a nice little one. You ever catch any out of here? 
He said he don't want to keep it. <laughs> yeah, you can get a big one. I just don't know about the chemicals in the water too, you know? That's what I'm saying. I don't Yeah. I have no idea. You ever fish out here at all? Not yet. I just started here. Oh did you? Sweet man. I'm just glad we got a nice day for once. The weather's been so bad this last week. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Well, you guys have a good day, man. Well, there we go, guys. We got our first fish of the day, which I'm just pumped about because I'm telling you, the fishing this week has been so just, it's, it's really been aggravating to me. Um, Just, I don't know, it's hard to get these fish to bite. So when you have a bite like that and then you don't get them to eat and then I'm just glad he ate again, but Got to start off somewhere. Got one on the fluke. Let's see if we can get a couple more. All right, boys and girls, we're at pond number two. Been a little tough start here. We're going to keep it rolling, guys. We're going to try our very best and try to hook whatever we can today. That's the plan. I'm still going to throw this fluke and see if we can get something on here. Just keep walking, dude. All right, pond number three. Please bite, fishes. Please bite. It's been such a struggle. I want to say they kill all these fish. Like I, like the water. Oh my god, he just ate it. <laughs> okay. Okay. I guess they didn't kill all the fish, but this water, like you can tell, they've just put so many chemicals in there, and it's just a whole different color. I don't know, it's weird. Still rocking the fluke. Got one bite in here first cast, so that's, that feels good. So hopefully uh, we'll be biting in here pretty good. The fluke that we're throwing, it's not like a regular pearl white. It's got like a little bit of glimmer in it. On the sunny day, it's perfect. If it's more of a cloudy day, I'd throw that like pearl white colored fluke. But this one just has like a little bit of glimmers in it. The sun will sparkle off of it. Let's see if we can get another bite. That wasn't a big fish, but it was a bite. Where I just have one boil on me. That's the better one. I know it's not. It's a little guy. <laughs> Let's go, guys. He ain't much to him, but he's a fish. <laughs> Pretty little fish, guys. Not much to him. Any of these fish that we've caught today, but that's a pretty one. You gotta love catching them guys I, I don't care what size they are today i'm just having fun going pond hopping today just trying to really get whatever bites how that weather's been it's hard to get them bites man but we got it we made made it happen right there well there we go guys fish number two almost fish number three i lost that first one in here we've had two fish in this pond so that's a good little sign maybe we can make it three come on fishies there's some good ones in here too i've caught some really really big fish in this pond in the past maybe we'll luck us into a six seven eight nine pounder that would be fabulous but actually right here on this spot so you got like this little crevice on the bank right here and there's actually a little tiny pipe a little culvert right there that this fish will hang off on and that's why i was coming right here casting and usually there's more fish than just that right there. So I'm, I'm surprised. Even where I had that first cast bite, there was a pipe there too. I would just expect there to be one, a bigger fish or two more fish on that than just a little tiny guy. Oh, there's a big boil right there. Right up on that shady. Oh, he just boiled on me. I'm going to just kill it. Let's we'll see if he'll eat it. Oh, it's a good one. 
Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yes, baby. Come on. Come on. He ain't a giant, but he's a good one. Let's get him up on the bank right here. Right here, right here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let's go. Got us a nice little two-pounder right there. That is a thick chunk. Got that old fluke hanging out of his mouth. That's a good fish. He bowled on me and it took me so many casts up there. And then finally got this baby to bite. And man, that is a good, healthy fish right there. Look at him swimming in my hands, dude. What in the world? <laughs> I'm not doing that, dude. That's all him. But that is a pretty bass right there. Nice two pound chunk right there, man. Oh, that's sweet. That feels good. <laughs> Give me some Cody. <laughs> Can't fall in. <laughs> Not today. That is a good fish, man. It's nice. oh, a chunk. That's rewarding, man. We, we've been fishing for so long today and to have a bite like that just feels so good. So let's keep it rolling, guys. We might be able to hook a really big one. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. Me and Cody talking about old man problems and <laughs> it's just, oh my goodness, yes. Oh. All right, it's happening, dude. It's happening. Somebody decided to just give us a break. Dude, I told Cody today, everything's been t testing our patience and uh, we pulled it through. We actually started the intro over again, guys. We hit five ponds. I usually don't tell you guys this, but we hit five ponds before that first pond that we hit in the video. And, uh, Man, does it feel good to smack him right now. We've had a tough day. And uh, to just catch some fish like that, it feels good. That was next cast, man. Yep. Next cast. All right, guys, we got three fish officially at this pond. Officially. Four fish total, but we didn't land one of them. And I'm feeling good. Finally. How much relief does that... That's that a lot of relief right there, Cody. Oh, dude. Oh, my God. All right, I can't break this hook off. I need to stop playing. You see, like, that weird grass that's in here? Very weird. Oh. This is a lot worse than it seems, guys. It's a lot worse. Yeah, I didn't just break off. I, I did more than break off. Holy poopy, Cody. <laughs> I hate you right now. I know you hate yourself right now. Dude, you, there ain't no need for you to help hate me. I hate myself more than I could ever hate myself. So, guys. <laughs> All right, Cody. Well. I don't know where to start. So, long story short, the hooks are about mile, yeah, mile, at least a mile, mile and a half away. One thing I asked Noah today was like, dude, let's try not to walk ten miles today. We're pushing like eight miles right now. Probably realistically. Okay, like dude, let's just do it. Listen, wait. I knew when something good was happening, something wrong was bound to happen. That just sucked. Dude, it was a bite too. That's what sucks. Yeah, yeah. It wasn't like I broke off on a bottom. It was like I could have had that fish. But we're gonna go uh, we're gonna go walk and get my stuff and then we'll take my truck around this way. We're back where it all happened. Let's make it happen again. So we're gonna be more fish here. That would be fabulous. Oh, what? Dude, that was a freaking monster. What just happened? What just freaking happened to me? That was a big fish, dude. I don't know. It just never pinned him. You could barely move. Dude, he was... He, all right, so that was actually a bite that I had. I heard... We heard somebody talking in the background, so we were just paying attention to that. 
it might have been the same fish that hit me earlier dude but he hit it and i never felt anything then all of a sudden i see him running to the left that could have been a big big fish yeah he ran to the left hardcore there might be another one up here but that that felt like a freak oh there he is oh my god dude yeah it's a freaking monster look at him running down the bank He's not even big. He's not? He was a one pounder. Uh -huh. I swear, I swear that was a one pound fish. What, what is going on? Did that not seem like a tank or am I, I just- it was gonna be like an eight. <laughs> Cody's like, oh my gosh, look at him go. <laughs> Bro, down the bank like all right, all right, I'll give him a little more. He's probably a pound and a half, maybe a pound and three quarters, but he was literally a pound. Yeah. That's embarrassing. Hey, they're stacked on whatever this is, though. Oh, God. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. please, please. Oh, I got him. <laughs> okay, okay. Me and Cody got 10 pounders on our mind. Look at that little golden bass. <laughs> All right, they're loaded here, though, man. We lost a good one. All right, we broke one off lost a good one i hook another one i think he's a giant and he was just a one pounder and then i catch this little squeaky yeah that fish i had on was triple the size of that but there's fish here man i just gotta hook one of these big ones i know they're down there whatever broke me off earlier too i think felt like it had some weight to him it is happening boys and girls i dude everything seems so just dramatic right now Yeah, it seemed like a big fish boiled on it. My fluke's messed up. Yeah. yeah, it seemed like a big fish boiled on it. And then before, dude, how was that one pound fish running me across the pond? Like, am I just... He had his weedies this morning. <laughs> Seriously. That man shotgun three Red Bulls <laughs> before he went Probably out in the pond. Dude, the muffins are another level. Maybe even a spicy chicken sandwich because that man was fried up right there. Or fired, fired up. <laughs> I want to know what I hooked earlier, though. That one was, seemed big. But it's like this the weirdest grass I've ever seen in a pond. And they're just on the edge of it, man, in the shade. Like grass does. It looks like branches. Dude, they're, they're loaded on it, bro. That's a decent fish. I mean, let's go, dude. Let's freaking go. We're smoking them right now. We, we've had a struggle all day. And then you come to one, one of the right spots and you start smoking fish. I haven't been to this spot in a couple years, guys. And it's paying off today. I mean, I haven't had a, you know, a giant, but uh, man, that's, that's some nice fish to catch. And it just feels good to hook some nice bass today, man. That one that was fighting me hard was about that size, Cody. Yeah. Maybe a little bigger, but. I, I thought it was huge. <laughs> Dude, I thought we had like a tank. Nice. I'm enjoying every second of this. Even the ones we lose, I'm enjoying right now. I'm just enjoying feeling a little bite. He was a little off. Yeah. He wasn't that far yeah. off. But... I don't know. There's just a lot of fish right there, man. They're. They are not being lockjaw right here. They they open in their mouth for this sucker. They're not being spooky either. They're not. It's crazy because like the the fish that we've caught today, guys, have been in two general areas, like mainly in this one pond, but they've been in specific little little zones, like that little culvert back there, that little pipe, and now we're fishing this little grass edge, shady bank. It's got hangovers. And there's a lot of fish in this area. Okay. I didn't hook him. Should bite it. He's right there. Right about there. Might be something down there they're sitting on. I was on throw that thing out there, let it hit the bottom, and let the bait do its magic. Couple little twitches. Okay. He felt big, man. It's so hard to tell. Judge these things. Oh my gosh, judge these things on the spinning rod. Look how small that dang fish is, but I want you to see something. 
Look at how good he ate that bait. Sometimes them small ones, they'll just tear up that bait, man. A little Twinkie. Thank you for biting, Bubba. There it goes. That's why I didn't hook him the first time. <laughs> the little tiny dude. But we kept seeing some like bait flicker out there, so there might be a little school of bass chasing some bait. I'll make a couple more casts out there in the middle. Give it a couple pops, work it really slow. or loading up on it. Yes! <laughs> I made so many dang casts right there and finally got one to bite and he ain't big. It's crazy to think that these fish have been so hard to bite today, Cody, and look how hyper this thing is. He will not stop. So not the craziest thing. You can't even get a fish to bite, then you pull them out of the water and they just want to go crazy on you. <laughs> I threw so many casts there too, guys. Probably 10, 15 casts. And finally got this baby to bite. I've been working that thing super slow. And he is not much, but he is a fish. And this fish is going to conclude today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, we just came out pond fishing, a little bit of pond hopping. Hit a bunch of different ponds today. It was a tough day, but here at the end, we uh, made a little comeback and ended up landing a bunch of fish. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like button, share this video with a friend and hit that subscribe button, and I'll catch y'all in the next video.